This is just a quick walk around the property to show you what's really here and kind of talk about what, uh, how everything went down and getting it all out of here and making this whole homestead happen. The uh, cabin was built over a couple months. We uh, pulled in dead logs for the log portion, done with a full dovetail. And I milled the logs square with uh, a couple different types of chainsaw mill. You'll notice there's not a lot of windows. It's because it's really hard to get glass and, and windows are cold and windows are also a way for bears to get in. We have a multiple energy sources. We've got the generator and we have solar panels and then we have a battery bank of six car batteries that's up in a loft in the house there. All of this was packed in on the horses. You, know, you can't get an installer to come out here, like no way. We really haven't had a chance to build another building yet. We tacked on this lean-to onto the back. One of the challenges of building a structure out here is just the amount of time it takes just to collect the materials is pretty demoralizing and you just feel like you're getting nowhere. The boards, each board is precious. You know, it takes you probably an hour per board total of work once you cut the tree down and limb it all and bring the mill to the tree or drag the tree to the mill and and everything else. The barn, we um, finished this in, in just a month. Logistics are a constant struggle to figure out the best way to get stuff in here. The conditions are changing in spring, the snowpack goes away, you can't use a ski plane, and the trails open up and I can pack the horses to a bigger airstrip. I wanna explore using a river boat to bring supplies up the river. It's, it's never ending. I guess that's, that's about it. We're not at the top of the food chain here. We're living in the animal's environment. There's a lot of ways to die out here. You gotta be tough to survive.